Hey everybody, this is Barbara. My husband and I bought a house back in June this year and we have a bonus room upstairs and I got to have it and use it as a scrapbook room. So I'm going to give you a quick tour. So bear with me with this flip camera because you know how shaky I am. But this is the stairs and this is the room. I'm very, very proud of it. My daughter and I, Carol Ann, worked real hard to make it unique, and um, this is what we came up with. So, there's my storage Jet Max cubes. I hope to one day have that wall completely with nothing but Jet Max cubes, but my budget is not in my budget right now. This chair right here is covered with a shower curtain that my daughter had. The chair is a rocking chair that I used to rock her and her brother. And she's 27 and he's 30, so that tells you how old the chair is. That little bench there is one that my son made in high school many, many years ago. And I thought I would make good use of it by putting a stereo on it. That is my storage for my cuddle bug, which I absolutely love. And my cinch, which I absolutely love. And here is the shoe, shoe bag, over the door shoe bag that I keep my punches in. And that's my, one of my lamps. That, I think that's the one my daughter gave me. And then she gave me this little spinny thing that holds all my Cricut cartridges. And I'm going to paint it white, but haven't had time to do that yet. It spins around like this. So... And then this is my Cricut table. I was going to get rid of this table and get me a small rolling cart to put the Cricut on. But after I put it over here, I kind of like it. So I'm going to keep it right now anyway. And then this, my husband bought me this or let me buy it a couple of weeks ago. Not that he let me buy it, but he told me I could go ahead and get it. I was going to wait until after Christmas and he said no go ahead and get it so I got that and my daughter gave me a quite a few of the containers that are on there and then I made this for the wall and then I did this with vinyl and then this is some more storage and there's my little scissors and there's my paper rack and there is my making memory shelf that is just over packed. And there's my curtains and my window. And there's a, something that my daughter made. And there's one of my bulletin boards over there. Y'all bear with me. Hope the lighting is okay in here. And um, here's another one of my bulletin boards. And since we're taking a tour let's see this is my son's baby picture while he was 18 months old there and that was my sweet little Carol Ann when she was 18 months old I have to hang those up and there's my cricket cover that Kathy's cozies make and my daughter gave me the pink boxes with the polka dots on them for Christmas and then when I went to her house a couple last week um, she gave me some more boxes that she had so and this is a picture of me and Carol Ann when we went to New York City oh boy that was a trip and there's a picture of me and my husband and there is Carol Ann and the two other girls that we went to New York with and oh I have to share this with you guys I have never gotten anything from Tiffany's but I got this. Look at that. Tiffany and Company. And I intend to keep it forever. I am so proud of it. And I will show you what is in it. Nothing. It is just the box. But the box is awesome. It is one of the best boxes I have ever seen. So my daughter said she was going to throw it away. And I said, oh, no, you're not. I will keep it. So, and then, this is my desk. We went to Virginia last week, and 
we live in South Carolina and there's not a I, an Ikea anywhere close by so I had seen this desk and I really wanted it so my sweet son-in-law Carol Ann's husband Will he works in Washington DC and he went to the Ikea there um, or somewhere near there and he got this without me or my husband he bought it and then my husband paid him for it before we came home and this is it isn't it the most wonderful thing um it has it's kind of different the, sh the legs are kind of different and that's one angle and there's the other and then there's the top of the desk and i absolutely love this because you can put things underneath the glass like the phone well the phone and then you still have room on the top so I'm very very proud of everything here um, this is my sweet little grandson Logan in West Virginia last year I think it was and this is my room so my daughter made those flowers and she sent me this for Mother's Day. My mom always wanted me to be Shirley Temple, so she had a sweet lady named Gail. Um, she made this for Carol Ann to send to me, and Gail's mom is is um, not doing well, and it looks like she's at the end of her journey. So if you all know Gail the Happy Stamper, please keep her and her mom in your prayers because it's, it's a terrible thing when, I mean, moms and dads are specials special but when a girl leaves loses her mom whew, that's one of the hardest things I've ever had to do is to say goodbye to my mom but anyway so y'all keep Gail the happy stamper in your prayers and her mom um, and there is the stairwell that you're not gonna want to go down because downstairs is not as neat as this is but I will post another video shortly because I have a new addition to my family a little Yorkie puppy and I would like to um, share him with you guys too so I hope you enjoy this and I will talk to you later thanks for watching bye bye